Hey guys, welcome to today's video where we're going to talk about NASCAR diecast in my collection. To start out, we have Jeff Gordon action card, Lionel hoods, and the grand entry kind of thing. Welcome fans. Carl Edwards sign, the best driver ever. Xfinity Zone pass for the Brickyard two years ago. This guy, Daytona 500, 60th annual running, which is neat. It's Austin Dillon one. Made it a little less neat. Two free tickets to Bojangles qualifying. And already happened, so didn't go to that. So Daryl Waltrip, the back of one of the packages, because it has a lot of neat milestones. At least these are 1992. I don't think he's 45 anymore. Have a Brandon Jones sign. I got him in hearts. He's just sitting there with his car. He signed it. I don't think he looks like that anymore. Hey, and at least now he drove a couple times in the Cup Series. So, I can say I have a Cup Series driver signature. Ha! <laughs> awesome. I have Kyle Busch. When he won last year at the All-Star Race. One of the few and rare, unbeat up Jimmy Johnson NASCAR Basher. Most of the time the Bashers were destroyed intentionally. But they're supposed to be strong, but they're not that strong. Here's what happened. That breaks. It's kind of neat. Just gonna leave them here. Perfect. <laughs> so you have. 1996 Terry Levine champion, which is what, uh, hold on, which is what this truck and trailer and the really tiny little Terry Levine car is supposed to be. Another little tiny cars, Daryl Waltrip, and then this little 27 car, and then Rick Hendricks's little truck. You have a little small Jeff Gordon, which is a little bigger. You have Morgan Shepard, Bill Elliott, and Dare Waltrip, which is where that came from. And then Ryan Blaney. Big 136 scale, I think, from Menards. So that's a neat. It's all plastic, but it's good size. He only has one car to race, though. Here you have Chase Elliott Baja Blast sticker, Indianapolis Motor Speedway ticket. And, oh, these guys. Here's a Matt Kenseth from his rookie year. Brad Keselowski from, from the Brickyard 400 in 2016. Have a lug nut, possibly from Austin Dillon at the Daytona 500 when he won it. So, if it's not Austin Dillon, it's still off somebody, which is still pretty cool. But I'm just going to say it's Austin Dillon. So that's what the guy told me. And it was free, so. There's a little Chase Elliott car. And Kyle Larson, which I also got at Daytona. Which is where that sign came from, was Daytona as well. So I got a lot of stuff at Daytona. There's Jelly Belly Racing logo. And here I'm starting with my die cast. So, of Terry Labonte collection of uh, actual Terry Labonte race to win when he won at Bristol, except for his roof wasn't that smashed in. Yes, it already was already scraped up, so I just kind of scraped it the rest of the way with a hammer. Uh, <laughs> Kevin Harvick, real powerful mints. Chase Elliott, which I dropped. Stinks. Little Jeff Gordon's including 95, 2011, and his little sprint car. And you have my Jimmy Johnson's, 2007, 
2018, 2017. And it's custom diecast. Then there's William Byron. Basically, out in the middle of nowhere. Okay, to the other side. The Martin Trex Jr.'s 2017 car. If it had the green around it, I could say it was the championship car, but it's not. We have Daniel Suarez, Eric Jones, Kyle Busch, and Hamlin. We have Kevin Harvick, and then now we have the Penske, Kislowski, and a couple more Ryan Blaney's. So yes, Ryan Blaney is like one of my favorites. We have Chase Elliott Mountain Dew Paha Blast. It's one of my favorite paint schemes. It's a really neat looking car. We have Eric Amarola, another one of my favorite paint schemes. It's a neat, neat car. Then, uh, like a little, I always do this little display in the middle. For like, last month it was Casey Kane's final ride, so I had a little Casey Kane right here. And all my Casey Kane cars. And not a trophy. He's never won a championship. So now this month we have Joey Logano. So, congrats. 2018 Monster Energy Champion. And I was like, well, all the racetracks are on the trophy, but the trophy has little trim on it. So I can say this little squiggly line is Watkins Glen, and this squiggly line is Sonoma. Okay, that was pushing it. Alright, so these are all the guys on the shelf. Come back to the next video, and you can see all of the ones from the box.